Okay, so the next project is here. This is my friend's uh, 2017 Dodge Charger. It's in for a one-step polish and a ceramic coating. And it's going to be a wheels-off uh, coating as well. Um, and um, I'll just take bring it in closely. But this is the second time I'm polishing. I polished it at the Memorial Day uh, holiday of 2019, and it's now 2021. So uh, we'll, we'll get this one going. Um, he's a second owner. Uh, like for this one, he bought it certified pre-owned. You can see it's fully blacked up the matte vinyls on there and every single vinyl matte surface is is stained with water spots they're, they're not going to come out and you can see that the hood looks like it was repainted just by looking at the um, uh, reflection in there so it looks like it was, the hood was repainted at some point i'll have to uh, do paint measurements if it is metal i can't i don't know but if i bring in the the light you can see it's pretty swirled up uh, and it's going to take uh, you know the, the good thing is that this paint corrects pretty easily so uh, again we got some of that we got some plastic trim that needs uh, to be addressed here uh, I don't I'm just gonna use a I don't know what I'm gonna do for this honeycomb grill yet um, these wheels also the tires have a tire dressing from somewhere and I was just t touching it earlier. Look, you lose a grease mark on my uh, thing. So we're gonna have to just get rid of the solvent base in order for the uh, tire coating to bond on here. So I'm gonna use him as the guinea pig for the uh, C quartz tire coating. These wheels are matte, and they're pretty um, they're pretty dirty. Uh, again, they're stained with water spots as well. Um, he takes us to a some place to get uh, a hand wash. And I'm sure they don't use they don't use the, the best practices there. So uh, we're gonna take these off. I'm just gonna clean them and coat them. Not much you can do there. You can see all the um, tire dressing splatter on there. <laughs> Looks like it even got up on the on the mirror. He took it to somewhere to get washed before he brought it over here. Uh, so then it's got the entire uh, matte roof, which is covered in. Uh, spots and these spots are not going to come out so unfortunately he's going to have to get that those re uh, replaced at some point uh, these, this trim piece I'm just going to go ahead and clean them and coat them and uh, again more matte uh, vinyl here and again this one's all spotted up and it looks like they, they wax the car or something because like they have wax and the things so I'll see if I can get rid of that this is plastic We'll just coat this back here there's really not much I just took off this plate just clean that area again more stains from where he washed it at and then the vinyl so this is I try to clean this spot here and I even tried to hand polish it with essence and it didn't take off the water spots I mean this thing stains so I think I'm just gonna go ahead and polish this out you're not supposed to technically polish matte because it's going to lose the matte surface, but it doesn't look too bad here. So if I just polish this out with um, like Carpro Essence and just to give it some uh, some color, and then I'll just coat it. And it's got this weird funky stain going on here. I don't know what that is. It's got another one down here. I saw it earlier. This is probably from the tire dressing. Just splatter. It's all right here. So this is the, the project for the next uh, go around here. Just to kind of see if I can get all this uh, tire goop off. I'm about to get some stoners. Terminator. I got to restore this uh, trim here. I'm not going to be touching the engine bay. I think uh, he's going to have to get someone else to take care of that. I told him I would just do the exterior, uh, and then I'll just give the interior a quick wipe down. Uh, but the rest of it's going to be up to him to take care of, of the of the engine bay stuff. All right, so that's the project going forward. I'm just just get to washing this thing, and uh, we'll go from there. All right, thanks for watching.